Well, another good reason to talk about the importance of getting a sports physical. Every year, more than 3 million ch children under the age of 14 suffer sports-related injuries. So Dr. Sarah Woods from the Austin Diagnostic Clinic is here this morning to talk about why that's important and make sure you do it before school starts. Thank you so much for being here. Oh, my pleasure. Sure. Well, school is about to start in a couple of weeks. Two-a-day practices are about to start in this extreme heat. And so it's important that kids all, all ages, 19 and under, make sure they go with their parents to get a sports physical. Talk about why that's important. Hey, well, you know, we do well visits and sports physicals and oftentimes we do them together mm -hmm. because we do think it's important for kids to have a lot of continuity of care and to, to have just a general well check top to bottom. Right. But part of the sports physical, there is a full questionnaire that parents fill out and it's important for a health professional to go through that with the family and we're looking for risk factors. You know, uh, concerns that might come up during the school season related to a lot of exertional activity. Right. You know, it also gives us a, an opportunity to talk to them about the weather, how they can affect their play, uh, and things that they can do to help prevent injuries. What are some of the things that are on that list? What are some specific questions that you ask the parents and the right. family? Uh, we know we're asking parents about the health history of the family, any uh, heart issues that might run in the family, mm -hmm. any problems with arrhythmias. Uh, we're also asking how kids tolerate exercise because uh, exercise intolerance can, can indicate problems with asthma, with right. exercise-induced bronchospasms, uh, with heart issues also. We, I want to uh, put up some stats just a minute. Um, we have a, a stat to tell you about ages 5 to 14, nearly 40 percent of all sports-related injuries have been treated at ERs. That's an astounding number. And the other number that we just talked about, 3.5 million children under 14 are injured every year because of sports-related injuries. Is there anything they can do besides the physical beforehand to make sure that they don't end up in the ER? Right. You know, we want kids to be active. That's important as far as their whole physical being. But it's also important that they, with the hot weather that we have, it's important that they get conditioned so that they're ready to deal with that hot weather mm -hmm. and get used to sweating before this, the season really starts. Right. It's important that the schools, and I think, you know, the, the coaches, they're very uh, aware of how they need to schedule practices early or late to avoid the heat, too. Yeah. And then, you know, to consider overuse injuries because kids, mm -hmm. you know, if they're the same sport constantly, sometimes switching up the sport can help them uh, exercise different uh, muscle groups mm -hmm. and not put as much strain on certain joints and that can help prevent some injuries too. And do most schools require that the kids get a physical before they start a particular sport or practice even? Right, absolutely. Uh, especially middle school, high school athletes are required to have those physical forms filled out and so that's why it's important to come in also to get that ready so that they are ready to play their, their particular sport. Good. Well, if you haven't done that yet, you can see Dr. Sarah Woods by making an appointment. You can call Four six zero three four zero four, or you can make an appointment by going to adclinic.com. Thank you so much for being here. Really, really good information.